Hey guys, Retro Badger here. We have a treat for you today. Greystar has very kindly sent over the USS Yang mod he has been working on. Some of you may recognise this ship from Star Trek Discovery. It's one of the 32nd century ships that we saw in the TV show in the background. It is armed with the refit phaser array, it has advanced quantums, and it also has triphasic radion torpedoes. Wait till you see it in action, this thing is amazing. As a first test, we're going to put this up against the Federation Battlestar Galactica. Now Greystar has very kindly sent me some other ships as well to try out, so I'll be featuring some of those in the next few days. But he's been working very hard with some other modders to bring these ships out and they're absolutely incredible. Okay, so the new weapon we have is this one. Now if you fire that against a standard ship, it will literally rip it into a million pieces, especially a TNG era ship. But as we know, the Galactica... I get the feeling it was possibly made in the same place as the Galaxy class from Hell. The same shipyard at least. So I thought this would be a good challenge. Oh, look at that! Wow! I think we've only beaten the Galactica once. And that was with Deep Space Nine, but it took about 15 or 20 minutes, I think. At least we've done some damage, although they have damaged our shields, which is an achievement, if I'm honest. The ship is very tough. Oh, gosh! Oh, no! Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa! What's going on? Uh. Okay, I think we're stuck. Have I wedged into the ship again? Let's go to warp. Please go to warp. Maybe if I fire the torpedoes, it'll push us free. Well, either way, we're making some progress here with the explosions, I think. Gosh. Don't collide into a 32nd century ship. Wow, look at all these explosions. It looks like they've surrendered. Wow! Okay, I feel like we have to go up against another enemy. Okay, so we're going to go against the Klingon Empire. And also the new USS Defiant. Ah! Gosh, that was zoomed in. Right. Let's go for the Defiant first. Let's so see our <laughs> phases. In fact... Yep, look at that! Wow! Apologies to the Defiant fans. I did not get any pleasure out of that, I promise. Right, let's go for the Klingons. In fact, should we do multi-targeting? Oops, blind fire. No, we don't want that. Okay. There we go, multi-targeting. Oh, we got some collisions. I see they've been on the blood wine again. Okay, well, the Klingons took care of themselves. Very polite of them. Oh, hang on, they've... Ah, they were cloaking. Okay. Wow, this battle's a mess. Remember, Klingons, you drink the blood wine after the battle, not during. Oh, and they're cloaking. Well done. I just had to. I had to see what happens here. Should I increase power to the shields, actually? I'm getting a bit worried. Oh, yep, yeah, it's collapsed the shields, but we're still here. Now, I don't think any other ship could really survive that. Even the Galaxy Class X from Hell can't. Oh. Well, there we have it. I think that might be the first ship that has been able to survive at least one blast from a Death Star beam. Well, thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.